One U.S. Congresswoman wants to legalize marijuana at the federal level and tax it just like alcohol and tobacco. Our Washington correspondent Rashad Hudson explains. South Carolina Congresswoman Nancy Mace wants to legalize marijuana at the federal level. When we have no federal framework for cannabis being legal in this country, it's sort of insane. Past efforts have failed in Congress, but May says her bill is different because it gives states more control. We want the federal government to stay out of it as much as possible and really let the states take the lead on what they've already been doing for 25 years. Her state's reform act would not only legalize marijuana, but it would make it tax like alcohol and tobacco. I think the bill does the right thing in terms of treating cannabis like alcohol and putting it in the appropriate federal jurisdiction. Under this legislation, those convicted on nonviolent cannabis charges would also have their records expunged. It would allow those that, who are serving today that are strictly cannabis um, in federal prison for that, that they would be released. Gary Hess says legalizing marijuana would help veterans like him suffering from PTSD. This comes from a personal testament of someone who has struggled himself and has used a natural plant to facilitate recovery, stability, and post-traumatic growth. While Republican support for legalization is growing, shortly after Mesa's press conference, the South Carolina Republican Party issued a statement opposing any effort to legalize marijuana. Reporting in Washington, Rashad Hudson.